Hey everybody, how you doing this morning? It's Marla. Hopefully everybody is doing well. This is going to be a, I think it's going to be a seven days of dressing. I'm not quite sure. It's not going to be more than a week's worth of dressing, but I'm going to show you seven days, I believe, of clothes that I put together for myself. I'm 62 years old and this is kind of the way I like to dress and I like to style myself at my age. I know a lot of people like these videos because they kind of like to see how somebody dresses. You know, as they get a little bit older, I am a little bit older. At 62, I'm on the bad side <laughs> of my lifespan right now going downhill. But I wanted to do one of these. I haven't done one of these in a long time. Now, I'm going to show you right now the jewelry that I'm going to be wearing in this video that you're going to see because you may not be able to see a good close-up of it because I'm filming with my iPhone and I don't have anybody to film me, obviously, because I'm not a young very big YouTuber. This is all done by myself with my iPhone, but I wanted to show you the jewelry up close here so you could see what you may not be able to see when you see me dressed. So the first thing I want to show you is my watch actually, because I have been lucky enough to partner with a company that I've partnered with before. I'm not getting paid for this. They didn't pay me anything for this. This is not a sponsored video. I love this company and I love watches. This is the watch you're going going to see me wearing in this video. I'm actually going to give you a close-up of this, but I wanted you to see this on my wrist. Now, I have a super, super skinny wrist, probably about six inches. It's a fairly tiny wrist for how tall I am. I'm a very small framed person. I love their watches. You can see the sleekness of them. And that is what I like about these. So let me give you a close up of this particular watch. I'll tell you a little bit about it. And then I'll come back and tell you a little bit about Nordgreen. Now Nordgreen is a Scandinavian company, I believe. It was founded around 2017. And what I like about this company is it's a little bit unique compared to some other companies. They've made it a high priority to give back to the world. World. I'm going to tell you about some of the give back programs that they do. And then also they have also made it a goal of theirs to have a environmental footprint of zero. So they are a Scandinavian watch company that's very environmentally conscious. And also through purchasing one of the watches, you can actually give back to a good cause. So let me first show you the watch up close. I'll give you the name of the watch and tell you a little bit about it because you will see me wearing this in the video and then I'll show you some of the other jewelry I'm going to be wearing in this video. So right now you're seeing me unbox my watch from Nordgreen. This is the cardboard box that it came in. And what I like about Nordgreen is you can really create and customize your own watch. You can pick the color of your watch, whether it be silver gold, rose gold. You can pick the color of the dial and you can kind of put it all together, pick the band. My watch that you're seeing right now is their native watch. It has a black dial. I chose it in gold and it has a five link watch band. I love that it has a very slim watch case that's slightly elevated, gives it a little bit of an elegant look. This watch is powered by a Japanese quartz movement and it is water resistant to three atmospheres. Now what three atmospheres means is you don't really want to take it underwater. They have a different line of watches on their website for people that are a little bit more active, you know, do sports and want their watch to maybe go to about a hundred meters. This watch is just three atmospheres. You can take Take it out in the rain, get it splashed by rain, but you really don't want to submerge it in water or go swimming with it. And the way this watch opens is there's two little buttons here and you just press those buttons together and then the watch opens up. So the reason I like Nordgreen is they have a giving back program. It is an integral part of their company. They really feel that they want to do something for the world and help the world 
world with their watches. So what they did was they have partnered with three charitable organizations. Let me tell you each of those organizations and let me tell you how you, as someone who buys one of their watches, can then choose which organization you want your donation to go to. Three organizations, Water for Good, Pratham UK, and Cool Earth. Once someone purchases one of Nord Green's watches, you'll see a serial number on the back of the watch. And then also inside your box watch, there's a certificate of authenticity. On that is an identification code. You go to Nord Green's website, you enter that information into the website, and then you can pick which of these organizations you would like. If, for example, you decide to choose to water for good, two months of clean water will go to one person in the Central African Republic. If you choose your donation to go to Pratham UK, Nordgreen will then give one month's education to one child in India. And then finally, if the donation goes to Cool Earth, that means they will preserve 200 square feet of rainforest in Latin America. So you can see why I like this company so much. You get a beautiful watch, which I love their designs of their watches. They are so sleek, so slim, and very, I guess I want to say Danish looking. They're kind of very simplistic. Their watches are really well made, and a lot of their watches are designed by Jacob Wagner. I was not familiar with him until I read about him, but he is a highly acclaimed watch designer. I just have always loved the look of a Nordgren watch. I think for the price, they are just spectacular, well-made, and they look expensive. I chose this one because I'm so thin anymore that I wanted more of a sleeker, smaller face, but you could even choose a man's watch if you like a bigger dial. Nordgreen is working with influencers right now is because they're having one of their biggest sales in history. 500 products discounted up to 40% off. You get a two-year warranty with the watch, free shipping worldwide, and and free returns. Check out their website. I will leave that down in my description box. They also have a guardian line of watches for people that are a little bit more active. Those watches go to 10 atmospheres, so you could actually swim with those. So that is my watch. Like I said, this is the native watch with a black face and the gold five link band. I will leave a link for Nord Green's website down in my description box along with a coupon code that Nordgreen gave me. So the other jewelry you're going to see me wearing in this video, it's either going to be from J. Crew, which is where I get most of my costume jewelry, or Princess Polly. I like some of their earrings that they have there. All the earrings I get are always on their final sale of the J. Crew website. J. Crew can be a little expensive, but if you wait till their final sale, if you can really hold out to a final sale, you will be amazed at the prices that some of their items sell for. This you'll see me wearing in this video. It's a short bar necklace. I think I got this for $10 on sale or something like that. It's adjustable in the back and I like to kind of layer this with other necklaces. It's just very dainty. I will link anything that I can find in my description box. A lot of the jewelry I got on sale so it will probably no longer be on the J Crew website, but if there are still some things on the website and available, I will link them. Next, these really cool, made in Italy. Let me see if I can grab them on my little pouch. They're a mixed acetate hoop. Really pretty. That's what this looks like. Let me see if I can get this to focus really well. And this is the hoop. It is just so beautiful. And I just think this is so pretty with my skin coloring. It's just gorgeous. So you're going to see me wearing these hoops. They have this little kind of gold bar right here. And they are multicolored. 
You're going to see me wearing another pair of earrings that were made in Italy and are made out of acetate. And those are these. These are called knocker earrings. I think they are so pretty. And these came in, in a, another color and I wish I would have gotten them. I'm so mad because I think these are just so unique. And that is all acetate and it just really looks very cool on the ear. Then you'll also probably see me with these, maybe wearing these in the video. These are just a pair of kind of unique shaped hoops that are also made in Italy and they are also made out of acetate. I just loved this color against my skin and that's why I chose this. And I also got silver plated burnished gold earrings from J. Crew. They're not a complete hoop. They are very pretty on, and that's what those are gonna look like when you see me wearing them in the video. Two more pair. These are from Princess Polly. I think these are called their Rosalia earrings, and they're very cool, multicolored little hearts. Focus, Mr. iPhone. There we go. Hopefully you can see that a little bit better. They have all these little jewels in them and they're multicolored. They're just so pretty on. I think they go with anything and that's what those look like in. Finally, I also have these from Princess Polly and these are great summer earrings because a lot of times you like to wear white in the summer and they're a little bit of a kind of a looped hoop with this almost a milky pearly looking heart and those also are really pretty for summer, especially if you're wearing something white or cream colored. Those are the earrings that I'm going to be wearing in this video, the one little necklace. Oh, the other necklace you might see me wearing are these. And these are kind of a very inexpensive necklace I also got from J. Crew. They don't lay as nicely as I would like them to lay because of this cord, but I got them in two different colors. I got them in silver. What I liked about this is they're adjustable. Adjustable. You can see in the back here, you just pull this and adjust it. Sometimes I like to wear long necklaces. It doesn't lay completely flat because it's not really heavy enough. I think that's it. Any item of clothing I can find, I will list down in the description box if it is still available. It may not be still available because I buy things on sale. Discount, discount. Uh, but if it is still available, I will link it down in my description box. So let's get started with seven days of dressing. This first outfit, I'm wearing a garment dyed chore jacket from J. Crew. I love it. It has a point collar with patch pockets. It is machine washable. Underneath it, I am also wearing another shirt from J. Crew. It is called their Classic Fit Cotton Poplin Shirt in Cocktail Stripe. The shorts are super old. They're probably 10 years old. I can't even tell you where they're from, but I love them because they are so comfortable and they have kind of a stretchy waistband which makes them even better for someone that's a little bit older and then I'm wearing my favorite very bright pair of Asics sneakers. If you see me on the daily I will be wearing sneakers. This next outfit, I am actually wearing that same garment dyed chore jacket, but in this beautiful shade of green. I love this color. Underneath, I have a J. Crew 365 stretch t shirt. I live in these shirts in the summertime, they're so comfortable. I'm wearing the only jeans that I ever wear. They're from Diane Gilman. They have a little bit of stretch in the waist, so they are perfect. And then on my feet, I am wearing these adorable pair of flats. They are also from J. Crew, and they are called the Zoe Ballet Mules in Suede. And I love those. So that is my entire outfit. And I'm also wearing one of the necklaces that I showed you at the beginning of this video. 
This next outfit, I absolutely love this shirt. It's another J. Crew shirt. I buy most of my clothes on sale from J. Crew. I just love what they sell. It is a shirt that's called their Classic Fit Cotton Poplin Pop Over Top in Ratty Gold Paisley. It's organic cotton. I'm wearing it with those same blue shorts that I had on before that I said were over 10 years old. I cannot tell you, you know, where to get these shorts because I cannot find shorts like these anywhere. And then the cute little sandals that I'm wearing are also from J. Crew. They're called the Gretchen Cross Strap sandals in color block. They have a uh, beautiful yellow and navy. They are so pretty. You're going to have to excuse the crazy tan I have on my ankles. I normally wear little socks and there is no way I can get the color of the tan on my feet to match the tan on my legs. I walk miles and miles and miles every day and my legs get hit with a little bit of sun so they get more tan than my feet feet. And no matter what I do, I, even with adding self-tanner, I cannot get my feet to perfectly match the rest of my legs. And that is the next outfit. Okay, in this picture, I am wearing a classic fit ruffle neck shirt in cherry blossoms. That is from J. Crew. I have a stretchy pair of these capri pants on. I don't even know where I got these from. Maybe ASOS. I'm wearing the same little suede Zoe flats from J. Crew. But then I also have this relaxed denim jacket that I got in E Crew. It's a very chunky fitting jacket. I really like it. And I'm going to pop this over this outfit and then you'll see the entire outfit that I'm wearing all put together. So that's uh, it for something I might wear at night, especially here in the mountain area where it does get a little cooler and I might want a jacket in a restaurant. I love this denim jacket. You can pop it over jeans and it just looks so adorable. I absolutely love this next outfit. I think it looks so beachy. I am wearing a J. Crew collared cotton beach sweater. <laughs> they even call it a beach sweater. It is so comfortable. I love this sweater so much. I wear it so much. I'm wearing the same shorts that I had in the blue shade. I picked them up in this kind of E. Crew off white color and I love them so much. I wish I could find these shorts again, but I can't. And I'm wearing the same Zoe suede slides that I had in the previous frames. Still rocking my crazy ankle tan. <laughs> and uh, one of my necklaces. That is it for this outfit. So comfortable. A great beachy looking outfit. Wonderful for summer. I love the pockets on this sweater. And uh, I don't even know if they have this sweater anymore, J. Crew. I got this a long time ago on final sale but I wear it so much. And my last outfit got cut short. I had to cut off the last outfit. I totally forgot to film, I think, my seventh outfit. So I believe this is only my sixth outfit, but my dogs interfered <laughs> with me filming. I'm wearing the same wonderful shorts that I have in E. Crew. I'm wearing a 365 T from J. Crew. The sweater I am wearing, I believe, is from Shein. It's a great lightweight sweater. And then I'm also wearing my most favorite shoes that I love wearing, my Birkenstocks. And that is my sixth outfit. I hope you enjoyed seeing, sorry I cut it short, six outfits for the week. And I will leave links for any of the items I can find down in my description box. Take care guys. Bye bye from Marla.